theme plays. Yeah. It's a nice, nice kicking. Fuck you. Fuck you, mosquito. You look like it. Funny thing is, the mosquito looks like a giant cock and balls. Good job. Has anyone ever noticed this? Probably. I think he also makes a return in uh, Raven Legends or Raven Origins, too. A lot of characters from this game do, surprisingly enough. I feel like those little blue ball things. I forget what they're called. I know this guy's just called Mosquito. Warbox is in this game. And I think, if I, rec if I recall correctly, um, this is maybe spoilers, so just brace yourself for the next few seconds. Um, the guy that you saw in the intro and the guy that I hand the dosh to, I think he's the magician in Raymon Legends. Or Raymon Origins, whichever one he's in. He's, either, he's the magician in either one of those games, so that's just what I'm gonna say. Oh god. Point. It's very advisable to have golden fists all the time. Speed doesn't really matter, but having a having having the gold power up is more important than anything. Because it means that you can like it means that you can open things and kill things a lot faster. Damn it. Oh, it's just getting faster and uh, what the fuck am I supposed to do with that one up? It just spawns when I when it's out of my view. Oh god. Oh god, I think here he goes. Oh shit. Yeah. Oh god. Oh, I'm one hit. Oh no, I was meant to grab that P. I wanna grab that PP. Oh, that sounds weird. One that hurt. He's just grabbing onto the bare eye eyeball. Jesus, man. Yeah! <laughs> I mean, jeez, man, that must hurt. You grabbed onto his eyeballs. You could have pulled him out there. What's this, the ability to hang? That's good for me. Yeah, you cheesy-ass grin face. Let's get out of here. Yeah! It's kind of weird. Like, I, I know Raven Legends and Raven Origins are themed around running, and you only get the running at the end of this game. What the hell's wrong with that? I'm gonna go back and get the electoons from this, that's what they're called. Merely because I can, and because I'm not going through any of the further levels because I want you guys to play them for yourself, if you ever get the chance. This is a good game, either pick it up when you pick it up for your own console when you can, or just download a ROM. I don't condone piracy, but hell, they're probably still making profit from this game anyway, like they care. So it's not like they're missing out yeah! much. I mean, hell, since when have you ever seen in the news Raymond won piracy warnings? Jeez. No one cares about these games anymore, man. And they should, because they're really good. Oh yeah, by the way, I want to explain the, the reason this game's so bullshit at times. You have as many lives as you can find. You start off with free from a game over, or just from a standard game. You start off with free. Right? Free lives throughout the whole game. And free hits unless you have a power up. Like that one up here. Like this one up here. Uh, Jesus. But um my my main point is that when you die, you only have five continues. And remember how you can find the power-ups for health, and you can find the extra lives or earn them. In when it comes to the continues, on the other hand, you can't find them. And there's around, uh, there's a basically there's a lot of levels in this game. And this game wants you to go through it in its entirety with just five continues and I'll tell you this much it gets difficult you will be begging for an extra live sheet I mean hell I can barely survive the music world without losing a few and losing it entirely I'll add um, nothing of that, just that extra life yeah, I've already got all the power ups don't really need them oh, yeah. You know, Raymond's main ability is to glide with his hair. You don't get that until, like, the third stage. 
And I mean that as in like the third set of stages. What the fuck's wrong with that? It's Raymond for crying out loud. Yeah. Oh, you bastard. I mean, whoever designed this obviously knew that Raymond was going to get these powers in the future. If they even made a sequel. But it's just kind of bullshit that we've got to go through them now. If you play these games in reverse, you feel like you're really limited. But again, that's kind of my fault. So my opinion is kind of in, uh, is kind of uh, null and void there. I don't know where the electrons are in this bit. Oh wait, no, did I already? Oh wait, no, I already collected all the electrons. I need to just ball it to the end. Hit Oh, don't kill me now. It seems as though the easiest way to kill that guy. Never mind. I was gonna say the easiest way to kill that guy is to be in your fist behind him, but never mind. Okay, so that. Oh yeah. By the way, to get to the final boss, you need to get all of these, every single one. No matter how difficult the stage is, you have to get every single electune. No matter how hidden it is or how off the beaten track, you have to find them. And these levels are linear, but with a non-linear style. Well, I could find my way to the exit of this stage in a pist. Oh yeah, you gotta go back a lot. I mean, you don't get that ability until like halfway through the band stage. The ability to shoot onto those rings. God, I remember when you used to get them just for free. That freaking fairy in Raymond 2. Hi there, guy. And he killed me. He didn't even touch me, but he killed me. But anyway, um, it looks like I got all the electrons in this part of the stage. Also, I died, so I don't have the stupid fist anymore. Balls. Gonna have to find that power up. But anyway, um, what else? I don't know what else there is to say about this game. It's expressed that the difficulty is bullshit. The bosses are fun. The music's good when you can hear it. I'll link us. I'll put a link into a full soundtrack video when I can. You know, give someone else some credit for actually going into the game and getting all this music. Oh yeah, skip the boss and just go straight to it. I appreciate that. Genuinely, I appreciate it. I don't know how you're supposed to get that. You're supposed to just sacrifice a life to get all those lives. Seems sadistic. Uh, masochistic uh, in its entirety, but, you know. It never floats the game's boat, I guess. Achcha. Now I'm fully powered. Come on, get on the ledge. Oh, I always die. I always get here at that point. I meant to pick up a P here. I know I am. Oh yeah, it's on um, it's on the hunter, isn't it? There we go. It doesn't even give you that much. Like three or two at most, or one even. I don't even know. I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> It's a good thing this isn't like Raymond 1 where they ask you to get all yeah. the... Raymond 2 where, it, where they ask you to get all the pickups. The lums. So if they ask you to get all the blue things, then that's bullshit. I don't... There's two missing? Where were they? Ah, well. I guess... I, I guess it's best to leave them. For you guys to find in the next episode of whatever I play. Because the money it plays is still gonna go on. So is every other Let's Play I'm trying to do. I'm gonna try getting Raymond 2 recorded. Please, for the love of God, help me out with the YouTube uploader thing because I need something else. I'm blaming my internet on not being able to load through YouTube and I'm trying and I will try and fix that at some point, no matter how. But help me help you. Also, give me some game suggestions that are easy to play. Don't give me any I want to be the guys or any high spec computer game ones. Just give me something that's easy to play and fun to play. So I don't want to be playing it because I have to. I want to be playing it because I want to. And the music just cut out. Fucking brill. And it's playing the wrong music. And now it's playing the right music. Anyway, see you guys in the next video.